John, thank you. This holiday season, things are looking a little different for the Dickens Christmas and Skinny Atlas. News Channel 9's Madison Moore tells us how they're still putting on a show, but it's not what you're used to. While crowds aren't gathering this year, a Skinny Atlas holiday staple continues, 2020 style, a distant Dickens Christmas. The executive director says this year's committee had to get creative. Essentially what we did is we took a lot of the fun aspects of Dickens that didn't include the characters, but you know the characters were a part of, and we tried to keep them in Skinny Atlas. Drop off letters to Santa, take chestnuts to go, and stop by local shops, which are getting in on the fun as well. It's quite fancy for Christmas trees, so we always take the glass orbs. In Christmas caroling, book readings and short skits are posted online throughout December for anyone who wants to join in from home. I think people are overall, they're sad um, that it's not happening, but a lot of people have said we're sad it's not happening, but we're thankful that, you know, you're thinking of us and we'll look forward to 2021. So I think people really are, you know, they're resilient, they're hopeful, they're looking forward to when it'll be back. And Charles Dickens himself reminds us all what matters this holiday season. It's called the season of giving and that is what makes us human. And if we just take a minute and actually converse with one another, we're going to see that we have so much more in common than we have different and differences. A message of hope this Christmas in Skinny Atlas, Madison Moore, News Channel 9.